I'm Steve Stoller, Plano's Media Relations Director, and this is Plano City News, your local only Plano newscast. This week we start with a sad story, the falling of a true Texas treasure, the quadricentennial Burr Oak. The giant oak tree was believed to be the oldest tree in North Texas, spanning more than four centuries. And if this tree could talk and tell you stories at that age, it saw Indians gathered underneath it. and traveling throughout the area. So if it could tell stories, it would have a lot of stories that it could um, pass along to us. We got a large amount of rain in a short period of time. And with the pre-existing conditions of the tree, having the crack that we worked on uh, a few years ago and some of the rot that was in the tree, uh, that amount of rain um, forced the tree to fall down. There are a few trees left in Plano like the quadricentennial bur oak that were standing before the United States became a country. Have you thought about participating in Texas Recycles Day? It's an annual event held by the city, allowing residents to drive through, drop off, and donate specific household items to community and nonprofit organizations. The donations collected benefit thousands of people as items are reused or recycled, keeping them out of the landfill. The event will be held November 11th from 8.30 to noon at the Chase Oaks Church parking lot at 281 Legacy Drive. It's not too early to start planning for the holiday season. The Plano Holiday Market showcases unique handcrafted holiday gifts from jewelry and handmade wood items to candles and soap. There's also a wonderful selection of tamales, brownies, cupcakes, jams, nuts and dips for your holiday parties. This year's holiday market will be held at Carpenter Park Recreation Center on Saturday, November 18th from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Sunday, November 19th from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. And finally, let's take a look back at our Rest in Plano Fest in historic downtown Plano. That does it for this week's edition of Plano City News. For more from our great city, head to social media. Check us out there. You can always go to our website, plano.gov. We'll see you next week.